this video, I'm going to talk about one of the best projects in the Restaurants Review project. This is a competition hosted by me, Alvaro Andres Pinzon Cortez, and I am a mentor, front end, and blockchain and degrees in Udacity. I want to recognize in this video the great project from my student, Mo Sovereign. He's a really great student, and he did an amazing project. For the recruiters and people looking for great web developers, I want to recommend you my student, Mo. He's a really great web developer. In the next section of the video, the student is going to talk about his background, his motivations, then he's going to present his project and do a live demo. Finally, the student is going to share with other students some improvements that could be made to the projects and also some tips for them to improve. Hello, everyone can contact me at my Google account uh, wwwmohammedfadda 123 at gmail.com uh, Actually, that's my Google account, uh, not a site. Uh, my LinkedIn account is Muhammad Fadda one to, um, Muhammad Sabri one two three. Uh, these links will uh, find it uh, on the video. Um, anyone want wanna help with something with uh, with any topic from which I listed before can contact me. Uh, and uh, if I can help, I will do it and recommend resource, resources too. According to my mission, uh, my mission is to, is to influence the front-end web development sector and maximize my capabilities, uh, satisfying my desire to learn. According to my vision, uh, this is a difficult subject to discuss because I can't determine my goals just now because I don't get the limit of my field or just know it. Uh, every time I make a career shift, uh, I just think for fill my desire not how to get the money, not where will work with this knowledge. So I can determine it just now. And according to my future job, I want to create applications front end, uh, front end React and Flutter as well. Uh, and according to the company, I can't think uh, which of them I want to work for now. Hello everybody, Mohamed Sabri with you and we will explain a small hint or a demo about our restaurant reviews app stage 1. Let's start. Uh, at first uh, we will open our project, by sh uh, press shift, right click and open PowerShell. Write Python, -E -Y -P -H -O -N, uh, dash m, http server thousand enter if you uh, that's if you install python version 1 and if you install python version 3 uh, you will replace python with python 3 uh, open our browser okay. right here localhost It doesn't refer to the port that uh, our project uh, fired from. With seconds, depends on uh, the server capabilities, that's our local device now. And now our project starts. We find here a map, filtration area, and some information about the, our, about products, like uh, the name of product, uh, city, the whole, uh, the whole address of it. And we will, when we hover on uh, a landmark from these landmarks, uh, the name of uh, the product appear. Let's click on it. When we uh, when we click on uh, any product, uh, that redirects us to a second page. Uh, um, a second page that has uh, more information about that product. Uh, let's notice that uh, ID ID three or that link as a whole. Go to home. Okay. And go to home. That's the same link. That means what? That means uh, every pointer here or landmark here is related to one product below. Uh, now uh, the point of uh, research. Search. 
our project our project uh, based on search on our data uh, like uh, from with our neighbors and cuisines or kitchens uh, like Manhattan or broccoli and cuisine like pizza we will find two uh, two products that has two uh, these two uh, properties uh, has the city uh, Brooklyn and the cuisine pizza pizza uh, let's uh, let's go to the second page view more details about that product we will find uh, a, a more deeper map about uh, the place of uh, the project as a product uh, more information about the product uh, and the reviews about that product and uh, if you uh, press on a view comment button a pop-up appear about uh, pop-up appear uh, with the name uh, of the reviewer uh, and his or her uh, review that's all till now good luck have fun and Ramadan Kareem uh, the tools we were uh, used are uh, Google Chrome browser to render uh, the HTML page uh, and any text editor if you want to develop to the, uh, develop the project and uh, Python installation. Uh, the scale we uh, use uh, be familiar with HTML and CSS, uh, HTML, CSS. Uh, JavaScript and be aware with Node.js and if you want to develop our code I suggest to improve UI by creating a new user interface using React uh, or any, any development, any technology you, you want to uh, second, improve UI by designing a new, uh, a new uh, user interface that looks very pretty uh, use API instead of our JSON file uh, to get the data from. Finally, I have entered this competition to learn more skills, uh, fill my uh, desire and my curiosity um, of what will happen next. See you and thank you. I want to talk about the importance of this competition. This competition was built with the intention of motivating students to build even better projects to keep improving their projects and to develop new features for their projects. Having better projects is going to help you with recruiters. Remember that recruiters are looking for projects that have the features that they build or use in, this com in the companies. And also recruiters are looking for people capable of creating new and interesting features that the company may need. So guys, I recommend that for these kind of competitions and for your projects, you try to integrate new tools and frameworks that are used by the industry and that companies need. Also, try to integrate your project with services that companies need. And also, try to build new features to your project that are attractive for companies and that may be useful for their company. Thank you so much for watching the video. Please, if you like the video, like it and leave a comment about the project or about this topic. You can follow me on social networks and there you can also contact me. Thank you very much.